Don't trust cats. Fat Cat Books. Please subscribe and press the bell. Life Lessons from Chip the Dog. Written by Dev Petty. Illustrated by Mike Bolt. Read by Teacher Mike. Meow. <laughs> Chip here. I have been described as very smart and also a dog. You're probably thinking, hey, Chip, I am also a dog. You seem incredibly intelligent. How can I be my best dog self? Great question. And because I am a good boy, I will answer three words. Don't trust cats. Not the fluffy ones or the stripy ones or the very tiny ones with big eyes. No matter how adorable they are, if it has a ball of yarn, walk away. Meow, meow. No, don't look at me with those adorable eyes. I will not play with your ball of yarn. Go away. Don't be sad. There are many things you can trust. Trust your persons. Even if they aren't grateful when you give yourself a bath. <laughs> no, Chip! Don't roll in the mud! Oh, another dog bath. It seems Chip isn't aware that a bath needs to be with clean water, not muddy water. Oh, no. And they throw away the wonderful gifts you bring them. Again, and again. Again? Poor Chip. His persons believe that they are playing a game, but Chip it's just bringing them a wonderful stick gift. If you're looking for animal companionship, trust this friendly looking fella. Uh, what are you looking at? I have a really good feeling about this. Oh no, that's a porcupine. It has very sharp quills. Those are the long sticks that come out of its back. If a dog gets too close to those quills, the quills can get stuck in their nose. <laughs> and it hurts a lot. Those birds and squirrels you try so hard to catch, you can trust them. They're laughing with you, not at you. However, Definitely avoid bees. Long story. And don't trust cats. It sounds like Chip got stung by a bee. That can make a dog's face swell up. That means it will look very large and painful. <laughs> Helpful hint. The small persons will show their affection in confusing ways. Try to be polite. Persons are way better than cats. Ugh. Let's go, Princess Muffin. Uh, ruff, ruff, yes. Grumpy Sprinkles, are you comfy? Meow. The little girl has put a pink rabbit hat on both Chip the dog and the cat. Meow. She also has put a pink ballerina tutu on both the dog and the cat, which is like a pink skirt. The cat isn't so pleased. I'm going to cough up a furball in your room now. But Chip the dog is just happy to be with his person. This is fun, <laughs> uh, but little person, can I take off this rabbit hat? Uh, it's a bit itchy. Uh, 
And even though they said you were going to the park that one time, but it wasn't the park at all. It's okay. It's just the friendly doctor. Where are, where are my balls? It's a well-known fact. When dogs go see the veterinarian, which is a doctor for animals, the doctor often takes their balls. And sure, he cheats at cards, but you can trust Grandpa. He's the one who looks in your eyes and says you're a good boy and a pretty dog, and keeps those special treats shaped like bones just for you. Oh, there you are, good boy. Who's a good boy? Who's a pretty good boy? Yes, you are. Oh, thank you, Grandpa. You're so nice. And these doggy bone treats are so nice too. Grandpa doesn't cheat at cards that you get on your birthday. Chip is talking about a game you can play with a deck of cards. If you hide extra cards up your sleeve, that's called cheating. You can only use one deck of cards at a time. Naughty Grandpa! The park is full of trustastic things. You get it? Trustastic? It sounds like fantastic. <laughs> oh, I crack myself up. You can trust that your persons will be very happy when you do your business. They are so proud. They even collect it and put it in a protective wrapper. Ugh. Trust this fire hydrant. It's always been there for you. Ah. Nina, Nina, woo. Uh -huh. That house is on fire. Get the dog out of the way. <laughs> Ew, sir. The fire hydrant smells of pee. Trust your intuition about others. Intuition means an ability to know something immediately without needing to think about it. This guy here loves sharing. That's called the dog sharing noise. Or is it the dog go away noise? Those two noises sound very similar. So be careful. Trust your nose. It will lead you to magical things you can bring to your persons. They will be so pleased. Oh, thank you, Chip. My grandpa's underpants. I really needed them. Ugh. You know what isn't magical? Cats. No how, no meow. Poor Chip! The cat is sleeping in his bed! The bed clearly has his name on it. C-H-I-P. That spells Chip. Meow. The best bed is always the dog bed. <laughs> because the dog doesn't like it. <laughs> Trust that any bed can be comfortable. If it's the right bed, you just have to be motivated. What you looking at? Keep walking, Mittens. Meow. I'm going to get you back. You'll see. <laughs> Trust that mail slot will bring presents for you every day. It's so much fun to rip them up. Trust Finnegan. Boop, boop. Meow. He doesn't trust cats either. <laughs> Don't trust the vacuum. It's an evil sucking robot. <laughs> Don't trust cactuses. Oh, oh, oh. They're very pointy. 
or those two criminals at the door? Cookies! Ding dong! Row, 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 row. Get away, criminals! Aha! The dog is so scary! Ah! <laughs> Run away! Luckily, those criminals are very easy to scare. But all these things are better than trusting cats, which you should never, ever do, unless they seem very, very sorry, and they share their special treats with you. Meow, yes, eat it, it's just for you. <laughs> well, then maybe you can trust them. Just a little. Mm. It looks like their cat is sharing a burger with Chip. But that burger doesn't look like it belongs to the cat. It's come out of a person's lunchbox. Uh-oh. That person is going to be very upset. It looks like that cat is trying to get Chip in trouble with the persons. They're going to think that Chip opened the lunchbox and they will be so mad at Chip. Run away, Chip! You can't trust the cats! Besides, you never know when a cat will do something nice, like introducing you to some new friends. Huh? Who's behind me? I am a smart dog. Roo, 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 roo. <sniffs> Stay away! <laughs> oh, poor Chip. The cat fooled him again. The cat introduced Chip to a skunk. But skunks don't trust dogs. A skunk will spray a horrible smelling liquid over animals that they don't trust. Even if those animals are a very good boy, like Chip. Meow. <laughs> Silly dog. <laughs> You're such a smelly dog now. You'll need to stay outside. Beware of dog? No! Beware of cat! Make sure your child is reading and spelling accurately with the Fat Cat Phonics program. Make learning phonics easy and fun with the virtual teacher, which allows your child to learn along with me. A Ant. Complete various exercises. Ant. Read unique stories written by myself, Ant, and Fat Cat. An ant is in ink. They're designed to be easily read in the early stages of their reading and will build up your child's confidence. Also, make the end of the lesson revision fun with one of the phonics games. Ant. Download some free lessons now at fatcatbooks.uk.